Hey guys, this is my uh, night vlog as Apple has released iOS 9 recently. I'll give you the top 5 features which I like. Check it out. Hey guys, my f first favorite feature in iOS 9 is desktop review as it gives a, a, a browsing experience like browsing on a Mac or Windows PC. Just go through the Safari browser and type in type in Facebook. So you got a mobile, uh, uh, regular iPhone based browsing. So what you have to do is just type, uh, tap on tap and hold the refresh button. So you get an option of request desktop site. So what it basically does is gives you the Mac and Windows based uh, browsing experience. So uh, this uh, actually helps in previewing many of the sites. Uh, in a real desktop experience as this is one of the uh, cool feature which I like and let's go to the second feature the next feature is um, uh, iPhone video recording where you go to settings photos and cameras where uh, you have a recording frame rate you can record slow motion in 720 HP or 120 frames per second or in 240 frames per second it's up to your preference and record in regular video mode 60 frame per second 30 frame per second this is one of the feature which uh, I, uh, iPhone has added into iOS 9, 9 OS this another feature which iPhone added is iCloud Drive well uh, I, iPhone doesn't basically have a file browser so what it did is it provided an iCloud Drive so what all, what all you have saved like the videos, photos and other stuff you can just browse through here and you can particularly select the drive, select the particular file and just you can share it you can like you can basically you can check the files there you can download files you can preview those files it basically acts as a file browser in iOS 9 so this is one of the features which Apple included in this the next feature is low power saving mode uh, settings battery low power mode what it basically does it makes the screen go black and black as and uh, activates uh, the proximity sensor and by conserving the power in your iPhone uh, by lasting much longer and this basically is the downside of it is you cannot use your phone while in this power saving mode so you have to go and physically charge it um, and you have battery percentage and before in iOS 8 you used to have all this uh, detailed usage of how much percentage the battery each and every application consumes the battery uh, now they activated per minute consumption so each and, each and every application tells you how much uh, battery it is consumed in particular span of time so this might be one of the good features uh, let's go for the next feature another, another great feature which I like is I have an Apple watch so so if I want to track the battery of the Apple watch so so go to the notifications and I can see Apple watch battery and my iPhone battery so this is one of the cool features which I like so I can, can go and charge my watch whenever the battery is down so this is one of the cool features which I like hey guys uh, those are five features which I personally like and there are few more uh, tweaks which uh, I uh, iPhone has added into iOS 9 where uh, one of these is a spotlight search in uh, settings panel and the second one is uh, new voices to Siri and the third one is a, a passcode with six digit pin so uh, a few other stuff into it but overall I think it's a good uh, it's a good uh, improvement and thanks for watching guys uh, please do subscribe to my channel and love you guys peace out